Good morning, another new day. Packing is going on. My wife and daughter, they are sleeping inside. And I am trying to fix the things. Few things already done. So now, inside bed and the tent left and few things. So I'm gonna pack the things slowly, slowly. And when they wake up, we're gonna pack the last things. I mean, the tent. Then gonna move from here. I hope you are <coughs> enjoying these vlogs. If you are enjoying, don't forget to hit that like button and if you are keen to watch this kind of stuff hit that subscribe button all right loaded the things empty our place nothing left except the stones now i'm gonna hit the road and bye bye from san hai kwan chang <laughs> that is the pearl and that one is the fish and nice beach anyway the down also yesterday i went there but that beach is nice as well there is a little bit dirty i mean for camping that's why we came back here again to camp yesterday uh, sorry before yesterday so two nights three days we camp here in this place enough for this area camping we're gonna go back towards jilin but after that we're gonna go a little bit down to beijing we're gonna cross this uh, province and gonna go to the beijing area there is one you know the and east part of uh, Great Wall we try, uh, are trying to go last time as well but we didn't make it but this time we're gonna go there and see how is the things there and maybe middle of the way we're gonna stop and if there is something nice we're gonna watch so let's hit the road bye 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 look at the people you know like this I found lady traffic in China. I'm gonna show you. This one. So when you visit China with you know like you are visiting some cities you can go like this market for breakfast and buy things because this type of market is there are everywhere in china like one area will have like this market you can have breakfast you can have lunch even the dinner you can have so if you go there you can find varieties of local things and you can enjoy whatever you like and it is uh, uh, not cheap depends which area you go you know some city like this this is tourist area is slightly expensive than a normal uh, area if you go to the regular area the things are really really you know reasonable price like uh, you know 20 yuan three percent can have nice breakfast like that so do visit like this type of place if you you know ever come to china and it is interesting for foreigners to know the you know culture and you know the customs here how they do I saw many, you know, oil, this uh, rig, I don't know what they call, I think oil rigging or oil rig, 
these things all out in this uh, area, you know. So I stop here to put the <laughs> gas. Jawar. Jawar. Uh, that's why I stopped to, you know, put the gas, but gas price is expensive than Jilin. <laughs> it is... If you can see there, it's 7... Next one, not this one. 758. We just finished adding gas. Let's see how it works. We already dropped more than 1000 km until now. <laughs> so this is our progress until now and this road I already drove last time if you watch my videos from 2021 you, you still find these places look look at these places and this side on my left there is nice view anyway This is the place that I came in 2021 and because of COVID and we don't have this report because it was just you know like uh, this area coming the pandemic so they want our you know report so we cannot enter so I just make round here around and then we went back to the same place that we came now anyway today I think we can go but I, here actually the main attraction of this place is that mountain they call BJ mountain I don't know exactly is like some pen cover mountain and there is one road here actually if there is no water you can walk but now you have to go by boat now cannot see the uh, that road because the water is full so this is one of the attraction here in this Chinzo city this one they call is in Liaoning province Look at the old guy is gardening, <laughs> watering these flowers. It looks anyway very nice. Anyway, this place is nice, you know, but it is hot. You know. I don't know, the temperature is uh, around 30 plus, I think. Waiting for the ticket. This time is not so busy. True, you have two types of door ticket. One is normal. <laughs> you can just go to that island and another one is island also inside you know have some places you can go there another you have to buy the ticket to for this boat so everywhere you need to pay money anyway <laughs> here normally the fees like this they are expensive these boats they will take and it costs 15 yuan and when you come back <laughs> you have to buy a, another ticket to come back so it's 30 yuan when come for person okay finish our halfway trip most of them they are wasted look cool <laughs> you like people throw here is like this a lot here Okay, guiding map for Mount Bizia Island. Okay, this is. You can see there, this is the A4 National Tourist Attraction. Anyway, this one is famous. One of the famous destinations in here in Jinzo. Vendors are enjoying their soft here. Not so expensive, but it's still a common thing. So you will not choose here to buy these things because you can find outside as well. That's the point. This mountain is like unusual combination of three hills. That's why uh, this one is a little bit famous. They are waiting for you. <laughs> what they are doing? 
Söylet. Five Mother Palace. So 168 So I just run that 168 <laughs> step and my girl see climb and my wife is coming from that side. <laughs> it is nice place, no doubt, but you can see there is the best room. So this is the problem, you know. That's why most of the places here too dirty you know, and uh, no smoking right in there people just smoke here you know. they don't care We are in Bijia mountain. It's located in the western part of Liaoning province, facing to the Bohai Sea and position to Jinzhou Bay. It is a small island in the sea and is also a famous Taoist resort. Here are three peaks in Bijia San, two low and one high, named for its shape as a pen holder. Here are many Taoist temples and some extra architectural structures such as Gate, Reality View, Lu Juting, Umu Palace, Sansing Pavilion and so on. Among which the Sansing Pavilion above the main peak is the most elegant. The most famous scenic spot in Bijia mountain is the Sky Road. It is also known as Heaven Road or Way to Heaven. It is a natural pebble passage between the island and the land, which is formed by the wave. It is about 1.6 kilometers, which is looming with the fluctuation of the tide. Whenever the wave moves away, the sea slowly pull back from the both side of the stone road. After that the passage will reveal and we can go straight to the Bijia mountain through the stone road in the island. After reaching the top of the Bijia mountain, you will enjoy the brilliant 360 view around the island which will make your work worth enough and I'm sure you'll not regret to be here. Our trip to the tallest hill in this island finished. Now I'm gonna go to the another one and the third one. There are Buddhist monks in the past here. <laughs> but now, just temple. Maybe there are monks, but I cannot see monks. Just the people who sell the things they are here. And this is another temple. Five female deity palace. Anyway, nice place in 
and nice wind in this nice and tropical <laughs> island you can find everything actually here nice view yeah. nearly finished our trip so this road will go to the bottom through other temples we already finished the second one now this is the third one so i think the today's vlog gonna be the, this mountain you know that we couldn't make it in 2021 so finally 2023 we did it here you can listen the buddhist chanting om mane peme home in this temple look you have this kind of bicycle <laughs> if you want to rent by the way bicycle cycling is <laughs> much more <laughs> you know <laughs> harder than walking we're going to change, not this one, as the big boss said, sir. Big one is harder to ride, you don't know. What is it? What is it? What is it? It's on the down, it's on the... Okay, we are doing exercise and paying 50 yuan. Unique horn, okay, look. Legs workout is going on here. Daughter is here or not? That's the point. Yes. All right, our 50 yuan is going to finish soon, and then we're gonna make one kora of Bizia San. So if you ever come to Liaoning, you can come here to enjoy a day. This is the. One of the eighth wonder here in Jinzhou, Liaoning. Many seafood if you want. like one, you can pick them. We have a crab, octopus, sails, mussels. My God, really hard work. Sweating. Back to the station. I think we're gonna take the boat and go to the other side and probably we're gonna go to another city tonight and stay there for one night and then we're gonna go to that place that the east of Beijing sorry Great Wall so we are waiting for this road now Oh my god, already more than 20 minutes and only until there the road is open. <laughs> when gonna open until the end? Probably we're gonna wait another one hour, you know. Not sure how long. And they told that sometimes this road cannot open, you know. So we have to go by boat again. So we are not sure we can go from this road or not. So let's hope for the best, but we are waiting here like this. Oh, 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 we are crossing through. As many people are waiting to walk through sky or heaven road or way to heaven, why not wear as well? This is something you rarely will do. And we are not sure we'll come back again or not. But definitely worth coming back here. This road isn't totally open about a food water still to move away but many people are waiting to cross so authorities let us pass i start walking without my shoes it was terrible decision so middle of the way i stopped carrying my daughter it was fun experience to walk here many natives had different belief to walk here and they have different stories to tell you if you ever visit this place come in the morning take some food and beverages with you enjoy all day in the island until 5 and then this Thian Lu or Sky Road or Way to Heaven will open so you can take a walk here. Oh my god, it is already dark when you come out. <laughs> so gonna be late, you know. Could be in our destination now, but we're gonna be 
one and a half hour we have to eat so two hours late i think gonna be in our place nine o'clock I think we just eat here, yeah? What do you want to eat? Just uh, anything. I can see. I can eat this everything from here. Look at this woman, look there. Must eat this, Pachi. Oh my god, chicken breast as well. Oh my god, chicken breast, three burgers, two chips, three cooks. Wallace burger and chicken. We spent only 50 yuan, which is... <coughs> Seven dollar, and we got three chicken burger, three Pepsi, two portion tea, French fries, <laughs> one chicken breast, <laughs> one chicken leg. So imagine <laughs> how cheap is it? Seven dollar. Three Pepsi is already cost seven dollar, maybe more. After that you have three burgers. <laughs> After that you have two person french fries and chicken breast and chicken leg. The oh. breast and leg they are different. Right. This is the bye bye from this burger. Thing. And now I'm gonna go to the our apartment. Thing. After that we we'll see how it will go there. Probably we're not going to go to the old town you know, because it's a little bit late. Anyway, let's see what we'll decide when we get there. apartment but here in China you know now you can rent like this apartment for even one night uh, like this because this is like uh, same like our house uh, so you know you can rent this one as hotel and you have everything here you know like a small kitchen and this is what is cooking this is bar whatever TV and sofa table fridge and inside toilet bathroom and this is decoration have two rooms uh, this is uh, <laughs> like this because it's convenient for us to use uh, like this thing because uh, you know number one uh, no need to meet the people you know he, you just work with the app number two is like family living and since uh, if you have even more people you can rent a bigger one and no need to, like check in check out is easy job here you know you just uh, you know go and leave the key where you have to put they have the locker room with the password you can just leave there anyway this is it for today. We're gonna get fresh and <laughs> clean ourselves because we are in mess. You already know because uh, two, three days we are outside staying on the beach. It's very dirty, so we're gonna clean ourselves nicely, wash our clothes, and get dressed. So, cheers. We're gonna see you in the next vlog.